Sampras has had trouble with that forehand return. He can't get his front foot down on it. Sends Rosetsky the wrong way. Sends the ball sailing past. Well, Rosetsky has tried to volley away from the forehand. But watch how Sampras backs off the backhand to find this one. Look at him work the feet. Stayed down beautifully. How's that? No more than half a chance. And Sampras snaps it up. So after over three hours and 15 minutes of play, Sampras stands there at match point. He's done it! Delight for Sampras. And you can see what it means to him. Gracious in defeat as ever by Rosetsky, and you have to feel for him. But look at the Sampras camp. They've been through it this year, but he's given them something to smile about. And Rosetsky bitterly disappointed. Well, this was special. Sampras earned it. I almost thought Rosetsky had that forehand. He didn't miss it by much. But this was another great five-set win for one of the greatest players of all time. Well, I lost the match. He didn't win the match tonight. I mean, that's the first thing. I mean, 5-3 serving for the first set. You know, double faults really hurt me in that first set, especially when I had um, set point at 5-3 last night. It's a tough match. Playing Greg is very difficult. You don't get a ton of rhythm. It is, it, you know, it's kind of hit and miss tennis, and you just hang in there against Greg. I mean, he's not playing that great. I mean, I don't feel like I'll be surprised if he wins his next match against Haas. To be honest with you, tomorrow's match will be different. A lot, a lot more baseline rallies, and uh, but I feel like my game's pretty good. Didn't really return all that well tonight, but I got through it. <clears throat> so Sampras through to round four and remains undefeated under lights at Flushing Meadows. 19 matches played in his career so far and 19 matches won. Uh, Barry, I get the feeling that there wasn't a lot of love lost out there between Sampras and Rosetsky. I'm just really confused. They, in their interview, didn't they play each other? Because both pref press conferences were totally different. Greg said he played awful. Pete said he played well. So I think uh, they won't certainly be sending Christmas cards to each other. I mean, it doesn't Sam say a lot when Rosetsky walks in and says he didn't play that well and, and he's not the same player as he was and he, and he also went on to say that he